Hello beautiful souls and welcome day to today's video. Uh, this has been requested from a friend of mine and it's gonna be EFT for fear and worry. So let's get to it. Take, please take full responsibility for your own well-being first. Even though I'm afraid, I choose to love and accept myself. Even though I am feeling afraid, I choose to love and forgive myself. Even though I am feeling afraid and feeling anxious, I am feeling worried and it doesn't feel good. I choose to resolve this and even though I am feeling afraid I choose to deeply and completely love and forgive and accept myself and anyone else in my life who has told me to be so afraid all this fear all this fear, all this fear, I choose to release it. I choose to just let it go. All this anxiety, all this worry. They're really not doing me any good. But part of me believes that they are. Part of me thinks I need this fear. Part of me thinks I need to worry. That if I don't worry, something bad will happen. All this fear that something bad will happen if I'm not afraid, if I'm not worried. But this fear is really uncomfortable. So by feeling it, something bad is already happening. Maybe that's why Roosevelt said the only thing we have to fear is fear itself. And I do spend a lot of time fearing fear. Being afraid that I'm going to be afraid. Imagining circumstances or I'm going to feel anxious and so I feel anxious just imagining them. Most of the fear that I feel, most of the anxiety that I experience, most of the things that I worry about aren't even happening. The threat is only in my mind. And to the extent that things are real. To the extent to which there are things I could or should be afraid of. I choose to know. I'm smart enough to take care of those things to handle those things or avoid those things even without the pain of fear so I'm clearing all this painful fear clearing this painful anxiety clearing all this painful worry releasing it at a cellular level 
releasing all the physical symptoms, allowing my heart to beat regularly, allowing my breathing to be calm and relaxed, allowing myself to be calm and confident, calm and confident that I can handle life, Clearing my feel all the way back through my past. I acknowledge that part of me. It feels a need to feel the fear. It's just trying to keep me safe. Because of the things that I've been told. And the things that I've experienced. and I'm clearing all that past fear. All the fear that I felt and decided that I needed to keep feeling and all the fear that I was told to feel. I don't need it. I can make great decisions without the fear. I can take care of myself without the fear. Releasing all the self-doubt. Releasing this need to feel afraid. And allowing myself to relax. I'm allowing myself to relax, allowing myself to feel good, Al allowing myself to feel calm and confident, allowing my body to feel calm and confident, allowing myself to have faith. And whatever I choose to have faith in. In whomever I choose to have faith in. Including myself. I choose to feel calm and confident. I'm allowing myself to feel calm and confident. Relaxing and breathing easy. Knowing that I can handle life. Knowing that I can, can, can take care of things. Knowing that I can make really good decisions. So I'm feeling calm and confident. In body, mind and spirit. Take a deep breath. And that's the way it is. I'm really hoping that you've enjoyed this video. Honestly, throughout this video, I had goosebumps. It really feels amazing. And especially at the end of this video, oh my God, I am so glad that I did this. And let me know how it feels when you do this. Love you so much. Bye.